Yo, what is up guys, so welcome to this video. Let me show you how to create background music for your game. Uh, this can be for any type of small game that you can create in Unity. Uh, basically, a lot of those mobile phone games. So, what else? Actually, uh, this uh, soundtrack that I've created right here, which I will uh, show you in a few minutes. Uh, never mind. Um, basically, this soundtrack that I created right here is basically just background music for the game that I created. And the game that I created in Unity is basically just a 3D, um, 3D, 3D Minesweeper, or whatever that game is called. So basically, you have to collect some coins, and you have to like uh, dodge these invincible uh, blocks or obstacles. Um, and yeah, if you keep running into them, uh, then you're just gonna restart. Then it's just gonna restart the level. And you have to memorize uh, the obstacles. You have to, actually you have to memorize uh, the obstacles uh, locations and then other uh, positions. And then basically just like try to uh, work your way around them and then collect the coins, collect four coins and you will um, move over to level two. Simple as that. Okay, so it's basically just yeah, this actually fits with a lot of um, indie games, this soundtrack. I just, I don't know what I did with the tempo, I just wanted the BPM to be at 130, I didn't want to. Yeah, I've created a lot of other uh, game uh, game soundtracks where the BPM is at 140, and they are a little bit more aggressive. Uh, it's like a fighting style soundtrack that I've, that I've created before this, and but this one I just wanted it to be a little bit relaxed, but also ha have some something going on. Okay, so first off, I started with the melody, and uh, this is what I came out with. Uh, I have Nexus right here, and I basically use the plug uh, uh, PL Matrix Spike, <laughs> or sorry, PL uh, Matrix uh, Pike, and this is what it sounds like. <laughs> sound for I don't know a video game okay let's just listen to the melody that I created Basically the kicks uh, and yeah, of course. Then we get to the drums. So basically, that was the main melody, the, the the melody that you just listened to. That is the main melody of this soundtrack, and the drums is basically just these kicks. Now, and then a little bit change, a little change up. There we go. Okay, and then um, at the start of. Yeah, at the start of just creating, just playing around with uh, instruments and stuff like that, I just wanted the, the drums to be like this. You know, you have the kick and then kick snare or kick clap. Oh shit, that's the wrong place. But then it just sounded really plain and yeah, really boring. So I created some claps. And I got the inspiration from all those Afro beats or Afro trap beats, uh, the claps and snaps from those songs. So this is what I came up came up with. And these claps are gonna play alongside of uh, the kicks. So let's just. So see, it already sounds really sick. And these are the open heads that that's gonna add a little bit of spice and balance to the to the um, I don't know the soundtrack. So it has this bouncy effect. Nice. The claps and the hi hats. Also uh, put uh, these hi hats hi hats in the middle of every kick. You see? So this isn't the most, I guess, creative way. I just wanted to create something quick. 
and bouncy and just enjoyable to listen to while while playing my 3D Minesweeper coin collector game. A hey. and this is a sub bass. I actually like this part. With the sub bass you have to So yeah with the sub bass to the sound so the game soundtrack yeah you just wanna make it a little bit bouncy. And yeah let's just take a listen. So yeah, it sounds really bouncy, and with the kicks, it's gonna sound even sick, even more sick. Nice, and this is the melody. Now then, you gotta stack the last. go and then you have a full song with the kicks the snares the hi-hats the open hats the bass the melody the second melody the third melody let's just take a look wanted to show you how easy it is to like just create some music for your own game instead of ripping music off off of all the people um, and of course you also need a DAW basically a digital a digital audio I don't know software or something I don't know what DAW stands for but basically just get it for studio or garage band or something and start creating your own stuff man be independent so yeah, have a nice day.